Hi, welcome to my channel. This video I'm going to create this short animation that you saw in ZBrush, Maya, Substance Painter and Unreal Engine 5. Also, if you want to see the high quality rendered images from this model used in animation, you can see it at my art station channel and Instagram page. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you enjoy from art and comment everything about art. At first I start with a sphere for shaping a basic body. Here I'm using move brush to shaping. For this part of body I'm using cylinder from arms and wrists. And for hands I will add cubes just depend on shape of the hand. For legs I also need cylinders. My creature has hoof and because of that I'm using cylinder here. So let's start the sculpting of main part of the body using clay belt or brush. In this section I'm going to shape a basic structure without any details. For shaping I'm using any references I want or my imagination, it depends on my whole idea. Body is almost done and I should connect hands to body. So let's sculpt and shape hands. I want to create thin hands, so I should scale down the arms and wrists as much as I can. For fingers I'm using cylinders, but this short part of the video is not recorded, I'm so sorry. I must create a little hose for nails place and I will add a sphere for nails. Created a simple UV for nails inside ZBrush. Ok, let's combine the body and legs. 
Try to complete basic shape of each part of body and then combine them together. The legs are also thin like hands, I can use a smooth brush beside the clay belt up. Here I'm using flattened brush to shaping the hoof. Okay, the basic sculpting is done and I should scale up the dynamic resolution. I changed my clay build up alpha to a circular alpha provided by ZBrush. I need more detail without a hard effect on model and because of that I have changed alpha. You should refine the model using just this brush and try to avoid using a smooth brush as much as you can. Here I add another cylinder for the head. And I am using snake hook brush for shaping it. I can shape the object like a tree using clay belt up with default alpha. Here I should make holes on the body for tree roots. After completing the main shape of whole model, I will send it to Maya for UV mapping. I retopologize the model in ZBrush and Maya I have been making a little bit change in topology. So let's back to ZBrush to making the details. Be careful, you must turn off Dynamesh. Here I'm using Dama Standard Brush for creating the lines and indentations. For wrinkles, I'm using Standard Brush beside the Dama Standard. I will create branches using my custom brush. And here I am using another custom brush to detailing the model like a tree. I must move the brush in the trails of the muscles.
I need more wrinkles for elbow and fingers. I add more wrinkles and lines using DAM standard. For the head section I must act like the body section. I want to add irregularity to nails using flattened brush. And with custom brush I will add grunges on nails. I paint my model in ZBrush but we're simple, I just need a simple texture at first. For high detail texturing I will send the model to Substance Painter. Painting in ZBrush is arbitrary, you can texture in the model 0 to 100 in Substance Painter. I just like to do it in ZBrush for a simple texture. Ok, the high detail texture should be created here in Substance Painter. I am using my custom smart material that I created before. Details can be achieved using cavity and displacement maps. Let's rig the model in Maya. I should add joint in each part of the body and finally connect them together. After that I can add IK and curves to control them. For fingers I'm using set driven key and connect the joints to curves. Let's try some poses to testing the rig. Ok, my rig is fine, let's create animation for model.
For a good animation you need many references and playing with keys in Animation Graph Editor. Ok, the final and interesting section is here, designing and lighting the scene in Unreal Engine 5 for rendering. In this section I should animating everything I want in sequencer. The main character, light, atmosphere and more. I will create most of the materials myself in UE. It's done. <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like it and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you have any question and any kind of comment about art, you can say it in comment section. More details and shots from this model is available in my Instagram and artistation page that I added in description. Enjoy from art.